This is so exciting. Hello, everybody. So Whistle Way Twerk has decided to venture out into YouTube. Yes, and what better time to do this than Isaiah's birthday. So this vlog is his birthday vlog, and he's 27, and I love him so much. He's the best co-host to my podcast. And so what I'm going to be doing for you guys is I have all of his birthday gifts here, but first I wanna show you guys first. And I'm gonna wrap them, and so you can wrap them with me. Let me start, of course, Isaiah's is obsessed with Miss Britney Spears. So I got Isaiah's cassette tapes that are Britney. Um, here's another one. This one's the Femme Fatale Britney Spears album. Now, I don't know if Isaiah's has a cassette tape, but you know what? These are just like fun things to just have around. I mean, he's the number one Britney fan as far as I'm concerned. So, I mean, he should have them. You know what I mean? Now, I don't know if he already has this vinyl. Isaiah's loves uh, vinyls, if you don't know. So if you ever have to get a gift for Isaiah's, when in doubt, get a vinyl. Now, this is Britney's Glory album, and it has our favorite song on it that we love to sing together. Do you want to come over? Uh-huh. Of course, I'm drinking Corona Seltzers. Yes. Yes. Uh, <laughs> so those are the Britney items that I got Isaiah's. And I also got, because I know he has so many vinyls and who knows if he wants to use. Now, I know I gave him a um, Baby One More Time album. He might want to put this on display because it was a very special vinyl. This I got from Christmas like years ago. And um, so this, you can put your albums on display. I got all these things from Urban Outfitters, of course. That's like my go-to whenever I need gifts for somebody. I always go to Urban Outfitters, Anthropology, Free People. You could always get like the best little knickknacks. Even Francesca's collection is a great one. Now, Isaiah also is like a plant lover. So I got him a little, little spritzer, you know, a little spritz. Probably put perfume or cologne in there. I mean, but um, I don't know if he has any of these things. I mean, it'll be interesting, but you guys will be there with me to have him unwrap all these gifts and the unboxing, let's call it. Okay. So um, come wrap them with me. All right. So I have all of the wrapping papers here. Because I was not really prepared for this, I only have Christmas wrapping paper. And uh, they're, you know what? It's like little trees and now it's February and it'll still be, I think it's okay. I think I can still get away with it. But first things first, when you're wrapping gifts, I'm sure you guys already know how to wrap gifts, but it's fun to watch somebody do it. Or at least like, how does Megan wrap gifts? Megbo, excuse me. How does Megbo wrap gifts? Now, first things first, I always take a marker, a dark Sharpie. Um, I don't have black, but um, purple will do is just to wipe out the price tag because you never want to completely take away, but you want to like show like, oh, I don't want to spoil it, you know? So in case he has to return them, I don't know why he would want to. But just in case, it's good to just wipe out the little price. Not that they were cheap or anything. I mean, it actually was quite, I'm not gonna get into anything, you know what I mean? I'm good to my co-host. He's my best friend. And you know, he's 27, so it really, um, you know, it'll mean something to him. Let me do this. Oh my God, I spent that much on this? Jesus. Okay. So, oh, no, I forgot my little system little spritz. And um, like I said, Urban Outfitters literally has the cutest, cutest little knickknack things. Anthropology is great for like kitchenware. You know, they have such cute things. I, I'm obsessed and it's like semi expensive, but like also semi affordable. And it looks like very fancy. So I'm gonna start with wrapping. 
let's start with the big things because the little things can be wrapped with the extras, you know? So I'm gonna start with the biggest. Begin the begin. So I'm gonna start with this guy and I'm gonna use this wrapping paper. <laughs> so. Now my mom always tells me around Christmas that I waste a lot of wrapping paper, but you know what? I think I'm actually, over the years, have gotten rather brilliant at it. And so, I'm gonna share with you all. Now you know some people can do like the one swipe with the scissors. I'm so bad at that. I mean, maybe that shows that I'm not a very good gift wrapper, but you know what? We do what we can, you know. I got tape here. Don't worry, everybody. Don't worry. I got it, okay? All right. Wow, I did it. So, I guess I might as well talk about something. And maybe I'll talk about the first time I met Isaiah. The first time I met Isaiah, we, it was Broad City days. So like Broad City was always on TV. And we have mutual friends, you know, and Isaiah would always be like, did you watch the new Broad City episode? And I'd be like, yeah, of course. He would be quoting after watching it once, like 15 different quotes from the show. And I couldn't remember like one fucking thing because I was going down in my mind when I watched it. And, um, ooh. Here's a good example. These will be great for the cassettes. You see what I'm doing here, people? It's called conserving your paper. Save a tree. <gasps> a tree. Save a planet. You know, it's the right thing to do. So Isaiah would be spewing all these broad city quotes and I would be like, yo, I don't remember that, but that's hilarious. Or like, oh yeah, yeah. And he'd be like, you didn't watch it. And I'd be like, no, I did, I swear. Like I did watch it. Anyway, he says that that's not how we met or became friends, but that's in my mind when we became friends. Because before that, I mean, I know we were friends, but we never hung out, you know, but it was through mutual friends. Okay. First gift down, here we go. It's always nice to just write. Okay. Let's just them. Then with the extra, extra, extra. <clears throat> oh my god, I gotta rate it. That was like a three. Isaiah and I rate our burps and farts, and um, we ain't shy, okay? Okay. Oh my god, I didn't even tell you guys the album title. This one's Britney Jean album. I know I said the femme fatale. This one's Britney Jean. Now the songs on Britney Jean are... You better work, bitch. That's a good one. That's pretty much the um, popular song on there. And then with Femme Fatale, dance until the world ends, world ends. That's a good one. Would you hold it against me? If you want my buddy, would you hold it against me? That's a good song. Also, there's a lot of good, mama, I'm in love with a criminal. How I roll. Oh, there's so many good songs. Femme Fatale is a great Britney Spears album. Highly recommend. There's a lot of good songs on there. So let me wrap up Femme Fatale for Mr. Isaiah. It's turning into such a big boy. 27. That's really exciting. Okay. Oh, I'm doing a good job at this wrapping. I think the smaller the item is, I succeed much better. Just more crisp, my edges, with the wrapping, I mean. I feel like I should be doing like a song wrap while I'm wrapping. 
There you go. Doesn't that look fun to open? Now I'm definitely gonna like take them all too, you know, but we'll see how it goes. Here's another, so Brittany Jean. And again, mother always says, don't waste the paper. So I'm gonna cut, even though I don't really have any more small items, but it's good to save, you know? Don't spend money and then not use your shit. You know what I mean? <sighs> Here we go. Now that's how I met Isaiah. So let me think of another fun time to talk about. Um, oh, how about how the podcast even started? So I listen to podcasts all the time. My favorite is Mark Maron's podcast. Um, I love Snooki and Joey's podcast. It's happening. I'm definitely a crusader of theirs. And um, okay, wait, the next one I'm going to wrap is Glory. Do you want to come over? What other songs are on here? Um, oh, Man on the Moon. That's a good song. Um, Just Like Me. That's another one. Great songs. I mean, Brittany is, she's a money-making machine, as Isaiah calls it. And, um, oh, shit. Ma, can you get me another Corona Seltzer? What flavor? Pineapple. Thanks. Um, Britney is a money-making machine and literally each one of her albums, there's just like songs that you can't recreate. You can't make songs like that anymore. You can't make songs like that anymore. You know what I mean? So um, what do you guys think? Should I like, you know what? I'm gonna keep the same theme of the little trees just cause you know, Thank you, son. You're welcome. Don't waste the paper. Don't waste the paper. Mom knows. You know what I mean? Momager. Oh, do you want to come over? Uh-huh. So, I don't really know what I was talking about. I can't remember. But, oh, here we go. Another one. Let's see if I can do the shh. Let's try. I know you gotta make it once. Oh my God, guys, I did it. Make those scissor hands. Oh my God, don't play with scissors, kids. Okay, so another thing about gift wrapping is you wanna make sure that it lines up with the corner. I don't know how to describe it. Hold on, let me. You want to make sure that you're able to like lift it and it lines with the edge. I'm on the edge of glory and I'm hanging on a moment too. Okay. All right, so I have that lined up. And I like to give it a little cushion, you know, because it's an album. So I am going to give a little extra paper and not waste this one because an album should have a little cushion to it just in case it falls on the point I don't know you never know accidents happen okay and you want to be prepared so I am going to give a little extra ja 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 with this paper I did a terrible job but I know mom said don't waste the paper but in this circumstance, like you do what you got to do. This is the, this is a vinyl, okay? They got to be pressed and it's expensive. Okay. So I did do a little extra paper on this, but I did a good job, didn't I? <laughs> so I'm going to double side the tapes. I'm gonna do it on this one. 
So you know when you like do little circular, I know exactly what I'm talking about. I'm gonna just put it all over, you know, on the base. So because I double-sided the tape, look, it doesn't fall and there's two gifts on one. You see that dimension? Look at the dimensions. It looks 3D because it is. And I'm gonna make it even more 3D with these bad boys. Now this I was gonna put in a bag. Don't worry, I have the bag ready. And uh, tissue paper, I'm not ill-prepared. But this I was gonna do a fun little design. Let's see how it goes. I also got a bow because you gotta put a bow on it. Oh, I placed it. Psst. It's like pressed, okay? So now we got the dimension. Ooh, look at that. Hey, it looks like it has eyebrows, but it's like mad. Make bow with the bow. Happy birthday, baby. <laughs> baby boy. My baby boy, Isaiah. I love you. You love me. We're a happy farting tree. Farting tree? What? Okay, so now this bad boy. We're going to put away into a nice little bag because it's breakable. You know what else is breakable now that I'm thinking about it? I made Isaiah's, and I'm going to give it to him this year. I'll grab it in a minute. Actually, I'm going to forget. So I'm going to grab it real fast. You can watch me. So one Christmas, and he was moving at that point, I made Isaiah's. He loves Pikachu. And I made him a little Pikachu. Isn't that cute? It's made out of clay. And it's hard as a rock. But I broke the tail off and I already had to glue it. So don't tell him. And I also got a sticker. So I'm going to throw that in the bag. And he'll be so happy because he's been leaving it here this whole time. So, okay, that was easy. Throw that in here. Yeah, there you go. So he knows, he's already suspected. Uh-oh, something's in here. I'm gonna just put my little Pikachu, isn't it cute? And now it's ready to go. We got Isaiah's gift, so now I'm gonna go give it to him. See you there.